So it has been reported that Benjamin Sesko is keen on a move to Arsenal, and as a result, the club are preparing a £45 million bid. The Slovenian is not the only player on Arsenal's radar. Victor Osimen, Alexander Isak, Victor Gukeres are also set to be targets this summer, but Sesko stands out as the ideal option. The RB Leipzig striker is being courted by a host of clubs including Arsenal, Chelsea and Manchester United, while there is also strong interest from Italy. But Arsenal now appears to be in pole position for the £45 million rated forward as the Slovenian international prefers moving to the Emirates after finding himself at the centre of a transfer battle. While well, sporting director Edu Gaspar speaking to the media recently, admitted that transfer planning for this window has been ongoing since as far back as January. The Brazilian has a very clear idea of the player type he wishes to bring to Arsenal when the window reopens on January 14, and it's obvious a top striker in the class of Sesco is on the plans. Now here are five reasons why Benjamin Sesco is the right striker for Arsenal ahead of the summer transfer window. Number one age is on his side. So Mikel Ateta is on the trajectory of building a young team for the future and Sesko, who recently turned 21, will fit into the squad perfectly. This also means he will be allowed to mature and grow alongside his potential new teammates. He is also putting up impressive numbers at such a young age so it is a sign of things to come and that he will certainly improve as he grows older. His youthfulness also means he may not necessarily be rushed into things and could even deputize for Kai Havertz at centre forward at times next season. There will be plenty of time to learn and improve as well. Number two, he is a natural striker. So over the last couple of years, his goal scoring record has shown that he has a huge potential of becoming one of the best strikers in football with the qualities of a natural striker. Having scored 76 goals in 170 senior appearances at club level so far. He also has 18 goals in 42 appearances in his debut season for RB Leipzig, which is a remarkable record at that age. Well, Arsenal may not have had the best of Gabriel Jesus largely because of his injury record and will certainly not want to bring in a similar type of player. His style of play can be likened to Manchester City's Erling Haaland. Both are big lads with electrifying pace. The Slovenian is also two-footed and good in the air, having scored five headed league goals last season. This is just one less than Kai Havertz, Gabriel Jesus and Leandro Trossard managed combined in the Premier League last season. A striker who can only score goals but is also dominant in the air will provide the team with the target man they have so desperately needed at times. With these qualities, Sesco would be a good option to call on when his team are struggling to find the back of the net. Number 3. He has a better record in terms of injury. Well, Arsenal do not need another injury plagued striker in the squad, which is a cause for concern. As a matter of fact, if the club must continue to make progress and also plan to win a major trophy, they must stay clear of injury prone players. Unfortunately, Arsenal already has a similar situation with Gabriel Jesus, whose form has deteriorated since his knee surgery. The Brazilian has not fully recovered from the setback at the World Cup in 2022, and he recently confirmed that he could undergo a fresh procedure this summer. Well, the thoughts of bringing Victor Usime may not exactly be a better option. The Nigerian international had an injury plate campaign with Napoli last time missing 10 games due to multiple injuries and ended the season with 17 goals from 2,474 minutes. The striker is now sidelined for 4 weeks with a fresh injury and won't be involved for Nigeria in their World Cup qualifiers against South Africa and Benin this month. Benjamin Sesko on the other hand shipped in 18 goals from just over 2,000 minutes for Leipzig last season with no major injury setbacks. Number 4. European Experience Arsenal will be involved in a number of competitions including the Champions League next season and the depth of the squad is a major determinant of how far they can go. They will need quality and one who has European experience at that. 
Although Benjamin Sesko's experience in Europe may have been limited, there is no doubt he could potentially replicate the likes of Pierre Emerick Aubameyang and Erling Haaland in excelling after he moved from the Bundesliga to the Premier League. Sesko scored 14 goals in 31 Bundesliga appearances last season, with 10 of these coming in 16 starts. Outside of domestic competition, Sesko also scored twice in 8 games in the Champions League. The 21-year-old has shown he can adapt quickly in order to perform well in tough leagues so he could be ready for a chance to prove himself in the Premier League. At such a young age, Sesko will fit nicely into Arsenal's young squad, meaning he will be allowed to mature and grow alongside his potential new teammates. Number 5. So with a release clause of £55 million, his valuation is not exactly too high for Arsenal and that will fit within the parameters of any striker deal they would look to do in the summer. He has had a brilliant season and for that figure, it will be a huge bargain. Moreover, Sesco will be a project, but one that feels like it has a high chance of succeeding under Ateta's guidance. Well, thanks a lot guys for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel and I will see you some of the time.